Hi Sagittarius, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Sagittarius, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Sagittarius. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the King of Swords, and this is Air Energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius Energy. So this is a card of someone who is appearing to be quite um, logical. This is someone who is leading with, you know, emo they're not leading with emotion. This is someone who can be aloof. Um, but we're seeing a direct, integrous energy with this person. This is someone who's honest and, um, you know, transparent. So let's see what the rest of the cards have to say. Okay, we have the Knight of Cups, Water Energy, the Six of Cups, Water Energy, and the Five of Swords, Air Energy. So this is someone who you could have actually have some sort of history with this person. With the Five of Swords, it could be that you've experienced some sort of conflict with this person or there's been some sort of a fallout. Um, rivalry has occurred, but this looks like a past energy. With the Six of Cups, it looks like you and this person do kind of go back or you guys just have some sort of history. And this is a connection that can feel quite intense. With the Six of Cups, it could even um, show like a past life connection, but there's definitely a strong emotional attachment present. Um, it does look like this person, um, there's an opportunity to set boundaries, to kind of clear the air in some way. Because at the Knight of Cups, there's this energy of someone coming towards you with a romantic intention. This could even be a peace offering with the Knight of Cups, but they want to talk about what happened. They want to address the issue. This is someone who wants to talk through it, work through it so that you guys can kind of find some sort of resolution and end things off on a, a positive note. Because with this Knight of Cups, is this feeling of wanting to have, um, you know, love and positive energy around the situation. So this is someone who's coming towards you with good intentions. So let's clarify these cards, Sagittarius. Okay, so we have the Five of Swords in the reverse, and this is Air Energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius Energy. So in the reverse, this does show a desire to reconcile and to put some sort of hard feelings behind any conflict they want to move past it. This is a desire to make up. Okay, so let's see. Okay, we have the Four of Pentacles, Earth Energy, the Seven of Cups, Water Energy, and the Seven of Swords. In the reverse air energy so there's definitely a strong desire here to um you know have some sort of blunt communication because with the seven of swords in the reverse that can be like a confession it's also a transparent energy and we also had that king of swords so this person definitely wants to make up with you they want to be on good terms with you um this is someone who you know they're not sure about how to go about it but they know that they want you in their life. With the Four of Pentacles, they haven't moved on. They haven't let you go. And they don't intend on it. This is someone who's very attached to you. And um, there's a strong desire to keep this relationship. But it does look like there's something that you guys need to mend first. Like there's a grudge that needs to be let go of. Or there's forgiveness that needs to take place. And, you know, an explanation even with the Seven of Swords here in the reverse. This is someone who really is willing to have the hard conversation so that you guys can make up and you know move forward on a real note so they will keep it real with you and there is still that energy of you know not just wanting to um forgive and forget so they want to exchange forgiveness and then keep the relationship in fact they want to nurture this relationship with the knight of cups they, there's this feeling of wanting to bring love into this situation um, you may be a bit unsure about this person though with the seven of cups there's a bit of a confused energy you may feel emotionally overwhelmed by this person or by this situation but i do see this person's going to do all they can to try to make sure that 
you know, you guys can move forward on good terms and put something negative behind you guys. Okay, so I'm going to pull out an oracle card for you, Sagittarius. Okay, so we have two cards that came out here. We have nothing is yet set in stone, mutable moon. And we have don't let pride get in your way, full moon in Leo. Okay, so I'm going to pull out another card for you, Sagittarius. Okay, we have finances and career financial issues are a factor in your love life right now so there could be something around career finances someone's self-esteem or their uh status you know it's somehow affecting how they um interacted with you and it's like they there's something they want to confess this could be something you may not even be aware of okay so i'm going to pull out another card for you sagittarius Okay, we have graciousness and benevolence. No act of kindness, no matter how small, is ever wasted. So you could have been really kind to this person. You could have given a lot to them in terms of your time, your energy, or your resources. Whatever it was that you gave to them, um, they appreciate it. There's this feeling of they, they, they never forgot about that. That's why they really value you. There's something you gave generously, you know, whether it was even just your presence, your personality, this person sees you as a kind person, a, a generous person, and they appreciate you. There is this feeling of um, nothing was wasted. Uh, there's this desire here to make up, to make something up to you. Okay, so I'm going to pull out a, a card for your advice, Sagittarius. Okay, we have surrender frustration frustration doesn't open any doors the key to resolving a dilemma or just solving a block is to take a breath center yourself and regroup so you may approach the situation more calmly okay so that's what i'm seeing for you sagittarius i hope you have a really really good day sagittarius bye sagittarius